mm -hmm. it's like, you know, small times, but like with the obstructive, they're stopping breathing like between 20 to 40 times a 60, every 60 seconds. <laughs> so it's crazy. Like you're literally That's crazy. Like you're only getting 20 seconds of sleep at a time. And it's like, you know, it sounds weird, but like imagine every three to five seconds, you're like, you're stopping breathing. Those people like have to have a, a CPAP machine. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't technically need a CPAP machine, but I found out very quickly that it's the medical field, bro. So it's just like with anybody, they're trying to get you in that system as soon as possible. So we were going through the process and everything. They contacted me finally because it's a very long process, like, and it's expensive as mm -hmm. hell. But finally get contacted about the machine. And, like, the lady was trying to fast talk me on mm -hmm. the phone. I was like, oh, no, can you email me this information mm -hmm. so I can take a while, you know, read over it. So I'm reading over the information, bro. And the way that they have this thing set up with your insurance is it's like a $2,000 machine, number one. But what they want you to do is, number like, first, your insurance will say, like, yeah, we'll pay 80% of it. But how they do it is we're not going to pay 80% at one time. So you pay, like, $300 up front, mm -hmm. and then you, you're renting the machine thereafter. So, like, I'll pay $300, then I'm paying, like, $80 a month. Mm -hmm. But the kicker, what got me was, like, oh, if you don't use this machine 21 out of 30 days, we will void our insurance policy, and you have, you'll be responsible for the whole machine. And I was like, I don't like being at the liberty of you saying, like, that just sounds weird to me. You're telling me somebody that don't need the machine mm -hmm. – that if I don't use this machine 21 days out of the month, it can void my insurance. So it's just like, that sounds kind of, mm -hmm. that sounds kind of wishy-washy to me because, mm -hmm. bro, like, keep it a buck. It's not like I, we live crazy lives. So you're telling me like, okay, boom, I know you're going out of town this week. Like, you got to take this machine with yeah. you and go out of town. Like, if I was to forget, if I was to go upstairs and like go to sleep and forget and do that, three nights out of the week. My insurance just be like, oh, you're not using the machine. We're not going to pay for it. You got to pay for this whole thing by yourself. And you got to keep renting it. On. Like it's, it was a lot of stipulations. And like I was going over with wifey and she was like, yeah, let's, let's, let's do, go over some other things first because she contact, she wanted me to go because like snoring. Mm -hmm. And we found out like, yeah, that CPAP machine don't stop snoring. Like you can get a CPAP machine. You still going to snore. That has really? absolutely nothing. No, huh. it's just, Forced air to keep you breathing. You. That's all. That's all it is.